Have a safe floor? I didn't even know I have a safe floor. A long, long time ago was when I was streaming. So it seems to be working now, which is good. All right. Second season's just been announced, so I got it on P the first season on PS4. I played on PS3 before, so um. Let's just revisit this, because it was awesome. Hello everyone, Mel is back. Or Denipla is back, whichever you prefer. Playing the Wolf Among Us. Revisiting it, so some of the shock and re shocking reveals we get in this series are not going to be as shocking, because I know... Well, if I remember them, I'm getting old, who cares? So thanks for joining me! Today again, if you missed it, a record for the day. Hottest ever in June. Uh, 103 now, and that humidity looks low, but remember, the hotter the air is, the more moisture it can hold. So 103 with 31% humidity is a lot more humid than, say, 73 with 31% humidity. And it is muggy out there. And it is muggy out there. <laughs> Other than Tales from Borderlands, which is my absolute favorite Telltale series ever, um, this and The Walking Dead are, are my favorites, pretty much. I think I might even like The Wolf Among Us a bit more than The Walking Dead, I'm not sure. It's awesome, so if you haven't played it, you should play it. It's a lot of fun. I can't wait to get my hands on Guardians of the Galaxy by, by Telltale. I haven't bought it yet. I'm a huge Guardians fan, huge Telltale fan, so how can I not love that, right? Just the look of this is so cool. Mr. Toad? <laughs> oh, shite. Listen, mate, I, I know I don't look human. It's a problem, I'll get it. I just stepped out the apartment for just a second to see what kind of damage this drug shit is doing. Just cut me a break, yeah? I'll get me glamour first thing in the morning. Cross my arm. No need to kick up a fuss. Hmm. I'm looking at a three-foot toad in a sweater. That's a problem. If you can't afford to look human, you're going to the farm. It's as simple as that. You can't send me up to live with those animals. <laughs> you know what I mean. Don't <laughs> see a witch. Get a glamour. Big beast, they're bleeding me dry, mate. The quality of the spout goes down, but the rates keep climbing up. Do you have any idea how much it costs to have an entire family in glamour? Hmm. I don't make the rules. Sorry. I Stupid can't rules. Give you a free pass on this toad. My hands are tied. Right, right. There's too much at stake. Whatever it costs, it's worth it. You don't want me catching you out of glamour again. No, you don't. Fuck, Fuck me, what's know. going on? See, this is what I told you about, Sheriff. You're just gonna stand there, do something, Big B, before he completely tears up the place. I should probably go handle. Yes, please. Thank you. Let's handle this. Yes, please. Bye. Furry prick dog shite. Tell me how to spend my money. Dad, the lights are shaking again. What did I say? You want a big bad wolf to take you away? No. Then get that fuck back inside. Oh, wait, Andy. Yeah, 
Yeah, it's more like it. God damn you! No Oi! Whoa, 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 hey, hey! You've got something on your face. Toad's my reaction. What are you talking about, you stupid girl? I'll fucking kill you! All right, everyone. Oi, mate! Lumberjack. What are you gonna fucking do, huh? Get the fuck out of the way before you get the axe again. What do you mean again? Buddy, this is your last warning. If you keep on like this, I won't have any choice but to put you down. Put me down? You got a shit fucking memory, Wolf. That's not how it went last time. This isn't last time. <laughs> I was just thinking that. <laughs> Oh, fuck me, Jesus. Sink! Oh, he's gonna throw that at me now, isn't he? Oh, fuck us. Take this sink and clobber it over his head. Rip the sink out. Come on, mate. Oh, there we go. Sorry about the sink. Well, uh, shell. You wanted to renovate, right? And kicking his shin. I mean, knee. Sorry about the head. And the sofa is a bit soft, isn't it? Had enough? Oh uh, yeah, that was a stupid idea. At least it's a fucking challenge. What am I doing? They don't even have a mattress. Ooh. Oh, there's a, the the axe, mate. And her, her, her. Yeah, tuck a ball, tuck a ball, bam. And let's behead him. Oh. Okay, this is not how this ended. <laughs> with the beheading. It's not Game of Thrones. Yeah, whatever. Well, looks get out of here. like a nice Look, axe. I'm not leaving until I get what's mine. You're not getting sick, Chris. I'll fucking put you in the ground. Shut up. Oh, fucking shit. Oh. You bugged my god. You're still bastard. talking. And still you talk. <laughs> Maybe I should write dialogue. <laughs> what the hell is going on? What happened? A little misunderstanding that turned into a real shit show. Don't worry. You saw the best bits. There's more where that came from, girly. Knock it off. Look, this is just the start of a shitty night for me. I just need the money he owes me, then I can go. What are you doing here? These lips are sealed. Are they? Why was he hitting you? Maybe you should ask him that. I will, but I asked you first. Mm -hmm. He asked me if I recognized him, knew who he was. I said I didn't. He started beating on me. Then you showed up, started beating on him. That oh. I'll cover it, hon? I'm the woodsman, you whore. I saved the little red riding hood from this monster. I cut this fucker open and filled his belly full of stones and threw him in the fucking river. That's who the fuck I am, you stupid bitch. Uh, would you excuse me for a moment? By all means. Hmm. His jaw should be broken a tiny bit more. My jaw is broken, but let me tell you this story. Ra ra ra. I think the toad's not going to be very happy about us demolishing his fucking building. Oh, shit. Nah. Yeah, he doesn't look happy. Hey, toad. My car. Yeah. And his car. Hey, give me a second. I'm sorry. Uh, it was no, Lumberjack's by all fault. Means. Take your time. So, uh, how good is your insurance? No 
can't be mad at you. I called you, and you come to help. I can't be mad. And even when you help, things end up more fucked than they started. Well, at least you're not fucking dead. You look better than I do. Shit! Here we go again. Deja fucking boo. God, we just broke his jaw and he's like, yeah, whatever, fuck, I'm pressing this button as much as I can. I'm pressing like crazy and nothing's happening. Am I just supposed to die here? Oh, fuck me, Wolverine. Oh, fuck me. Not awkward at all. Okay. Uh, as you were. What are you doing? I'm just getting what he owes me. You all right back there? I mean, your eyes and the teeth. You're not really supposed to do that, are you? Not if I can avoid it. Great. The guy's got an axe in his brain. He's not feeling that. It's more from me. He'll be fine. I'll kill you, you fucking bitch. Let me help you. <laughs> He's had enough. He's a feeble. Son of a bitch can take plenty. <laughs> Jesus. Excuse me, ma'am. Excuse me. Sorry about potential construction noise you hear in the background. My neighbor is drilling something. And that's not a euphemism. I've got lighter. Why did I pick up the matches? Hmm. Who do you work for, really? These lips are sealed. Again. Sorry. Oh, she can't say. It's like she's under a spell. She always says exactly the same hey, thing. You like my ribbon? These lips are sealed. Thank you. We probably have. We all sort of knew each other at one point or another. But things change, I guess. I guess. Shit. Hmm. Stop. We don't have to make any more of a thing out of it than it already is. He hit you. He needs to pay for that. He's got nothing to give, Sheriff. I checked. Besides, I just swung an axe into the guy's head. I'd say we're even. She's got a valid I point. Arresting you. I'm not going to be doing this for much longer. So, now's your chance. <laughs> kiss her, kiss her. <laughs> Awkward. How much was the OJ? A hundred. I'm guessing it'd be bad for you to show up empty-handed. I'll be Perhaps. fine. Let's see, I've got, uh... It's 20, 40, 7, 8, 58. It's all I got. Uh, it'll help, right? Take it. It's okay. I'll be fine. You've done enough, really. Just take the money, okay? You got me out of a bad situation back there. Thanks. I'm still gonna need a statement. 
I have to go drop off what I have. Meet me back at my office, then. It's a little late for an office visit, Sheriff. I'll swing by your apartment. How do you know where I am? You live in the smallest apartment in the woodlands. Everyone knows that. Yeah, everyone does, huh? Good to know. You should get cleaned up. You look like shit. And I don't use that term lightly. Some of these look pretty bad. Wow. Tell me what you really think. Hey. I need to tell you something. What is it? Your lips are unsealed? <laughs> You're not as bad as everyone says you are. Why, thank you. I'll see you around, Wolf. Ma'am. I have a feeling we're not going to see her again. No matter how much you get smashed around and land on a car and get beaten the fuck up, your cigarettes are always perfectly fine. <laughs> da 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 da. Pretty. I love Telltale games. Seriously, it's so cool. I mean, first The Walking Dead, and then I think the second one that I played was Wolf Among Us, and it was really fucking awesome. Game of Thrones was nice, and then Tales, of from, Tales from the Borderlands just blew me away. It was so funny and witty, and the structure was interesting. It's never been done before like that. It was just fucking awesome. It's the highlight. It's one of the best games ever. I know a lot of people are saying that it's just like a few quick time events, it's not much of a game, you don't really do much. But, I mean, I love movies, I love games, and Telltale kind of smushes it together perfectly. You have stories, you have characters, and a tiny bit of gameplay. And it's awesome. Oh, I'm walking. Okay, I'm walking. Can you walk faster? Yes, you can. Luxury apartments. I clearly do not live here. Or do I? Oh, wait, what's this? Oh. Sometimes be a disciplinarian. Sometimes people are twats. Who that? Who you? It's a lady. Come on out. Come on, All man. All right. All right. Beauty. She reminds me of Ashley Johnson. Hello, Big B. Hmm. <laughs> Stay off the grass. Fuck that. Wasn't expecting anyone. Why'd you hide when I walked up? Well, I didn't know who it was. You can't be too careful these days. No, can't. Damn it, I'm late. Laters. Please, Big B. Promise me you won't tell Beast you saw me. He worries too much as it is, and it would just make my life a lot easier. Look, whatever it is, it's between you and Beast. I'm staying out of it. Oh, so she's beauty. Okay, cool. I don't have time to go into it right now. I'll explain it all to you later. I will. You don't have, have to explain to anything to me. Who am I, your dad? It's not what you might be thinking.
Hola, ¿qué pasa? Hey, you wink. Probably for the best. Yeah, but he gets paid to do that. How awesome is that? Been a while since I got any mail. Oh, we actually do live here in the luxury apartment. Seriously. Day in a row. Hmm. Wait, well, come again. I didn't read that properly. Where am I trying to go? Why am I here? Can't remember. I'm just gonna press every single button. <laughs> It automatically takes you wherever you need to go. Who dead? Who dead? You beast. Bigby. Hey, wait up. Oh, Have you crap. seen my wife? Have um, you seen Beauty? Um. So, have you? I'm staying out of it. Out of what? Whatever it is, beast. I'm not a marriage counselor. I'm staying out of it. Something's going on. Those are the luxury apartments? They look like horrible apartments. Oh, I didn't check the clock when I started streaming. Oh. Ketchup and, and cigarettes? What was that? No. Oh. An ice cave. Yeah, well, you won't do nothing if you don't put water in it. We clearly have problems with. Ah! Hey. It's the piggy! Colin. Yeah. Colin. Colin the piggy. Oh, hey, Big B. I'm in your chair, huh? Mm hmm. I've only got the one. So, yeah. You're in it. Bacon bum. Got a smoke? Thanks. Couple Smoking bacon. Even on that house you owe me. This has got to stop. You can't keep sneaking off the farm like this. The fresh air and sunshine pitch they sell you on is bullshit. I didn't escape out of the homelands to end up in some prison, okay? 
Don't send me back there, Bigby. You don't know what it's like, okay? You haven't been there. Come on. That's a little dramatic. That for me? Nope. Mm -mm. The house didn't blow itself down, Bigby. That's all I'm saying. Do Why the other two piggies? Now, I'm not saying it's reason enough for me to have definitely been offered a drink, but, uh... It would have helped ease some of the pain you once caused me, yes. It also would have shown everyone how different you are now. Nice. Mm. I take it all back. This is why everyone hates you. Hmm. Gotta be consistent. So, everyone hates me. Nah, I'm just giving you shit. I'm doing my best here. Clearly that is not true. What with the selfishness with the bourbon. But, uh, no. Um, hate's the wrong word. Not everyone hates me because I'm not you giving you bourbon. Anything. Bacon. You a lot of people back in your day. I thought we were all supposed to have a fresh start here. I can't change the past. Well, you can't change people's memories either. You can make new ones. I'm not saying it's fair. But it's real. People are scared of you. I mean, look at your hands. He attacked me first, man. I was just defending myself. A fable, myself. A fable right? I'm sure you're not going around punching Mondays. It wasn't my fault. I get the impression you say that a lot. You think my job is easy? You try keeping a bunch of fables from killing each other. How do you think this all works? I don't know. How? By being big and being bad. By being big and being bad. Big and bad. Say that shit in front of people. It's embarrassing. That's the attitude that gets you in trouble. I'm sure you were shitty to everyone you came across tonight. Not everyone. Name one. <laughs> what was her name? M. 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 Yeah. Uh, I don't actually know her name. Awesome. Great example. Fuck you, Bacon. Life is easier with friends, Bigby. And we live a long fucking time. I know you like this whole lone wolf thing you got going for yourself. But I've seen the way you look at snow, okay? You're not fooling me. Will you shut up? Well, maybe if my throat wasn't so parched, I wouldn't have to keep on. Oh my god, have to bottle. That doesn't make Just give sense. me a drink, please. Colin, enough already. I haven't slept in two days. Smoky bacon drenched in whiskey. Yeah. I get in two seconds of shut eye before I. All right, have the Look, fucking thing. If I give you this, will you let me sleep? Yeah, yeah, all right. Probably. Colin, why don't you sit on this pan and I just turn the heat up? Thanks, Big B. Want a straw for that? Oh, you don't need a straw? Okay, you're such a pig. Why am I sleeping in the armchair? Because I'm big and bad and awesome. Who is it? Oh, must be someone nice, okay. Well, hello. Big B. Snow. Oh, hello. With me. Um, okay. Anyone close the door? Colin, close Snow. the door. Snow. What? What up? Sorry, I'm... What is it? What happened? I just can't get into it this second. We need to hurry to... Hi. Who dance? Hello. Good morning. Or evening. <laughs> yeah. Yo, Freckles, who are you? These Awkward accountant. We need to be careful. We'll talk outside. Okay. Conspiracy. I've played this before, but I don't really remember anything, which is kind of awesome. 
Oh. Oh! Oh boy. Now I remember that one. It's a bit annoying that Twitch streaming blocks out the trophy popping with like a quarter of the screen black bullshit. I have no idea why it does that. Hmm. Who is it? Oh, yeah, right. We're not seeing her again. I didn't even get your name. You knew this girl? Is she not a Mundy, right? Who was she? I thought I knew everyone in Fate Town. Just a girl. We didn't have a whole lot of time to chat. Woodsman. He attacked her, I stepped in. And he threatened to kill us both. No. You don't think he... I don't think anything yet. Just give me a second. It's just... terrible. So, who found her? I did. She was just like this. I didn't touch her. I grabbed Grimble's jacket to cover her with. Then, I came to get you right away. No one else was with you? No. Big P, did one of us do this? There hasn't been a murder in Fable Town in a long time. All the more reason we shouldn't start a panic before we know what's going on. I'll have a look around. We don't have much time before people will be coming through here. You just contaminated evidence by touching it. She was placed here with some care. What do you mean? You can see that someone didn't just toss her here. She was deliberately placed for us to find. No, someone just didn't football what kick her over here. Do this? My lips are sealed. Oh, lips are not as sealed what? as we thought it was. Pick it, pick it. Sorry, ma'am. Oh fuck me! It's oh her the thingy. It. There's some kind of symbol here. Hmm. She swallowed it. I don't recognize it. Neither do I. Hmm. Strange cut. What did this to her? What could do something like that? Either something very sharp, or something with magic attached to it. Or something very sharp with magic attached to it. Didn't bag it. Someone bag it. I'm, I'm sorry. This is just so surreal. You could just tell that Snow is going to be the love interest because she's so pretty. What do you want to do next? We still have some time. I should keep investigating the area. Okay. Good idea. Yeah. Let's see a side of shit out of this. Talk to you first. You found her. You all right? Yes. Thanks. But you should hurry. We don't have much time left. We should head back inside soon. <laughs> oh, bushes. Who's hiding? Nobody there. Oh. False alarm. No, mind me. Oh, there's uh, nothing there. There's uh, anything in the foreground. Anything in the background? Excuse me, ma'am. Um, anything? Oh, can't go this way. Can't go that way. I'm just exercising my legs. Nice ass. Uh, anything here? No, that's the door. Any? Oh! Oh, right, right. Blood spatter. Thingy me bobs. Blood. Drops of blood. I'd say it's been here. Hour maybe. Are you gonna lick it? That how you gonna investigate shit? Forward, onward, walk all over the CSI stuff. 
signs that it's been here long. Pick it, pick it, pick everything up. It's an adventure. Pick everything up. Maverick. Looks like jeans. Doesn't tell me much. Yeah, but that looks like it's a rubbish pair of jeans if it rips like that. Someone jumped over this. Just some loose trash. Hmm. Thing with Bob. Blood. Still wet. Sharp enough. Lick it, your wolf. Lick it. Yep. More blood. Someone might have hopped the fence, got caught, then left the trail I found earlier. Eh. Wait. Uh. Do we not want to? Is there nothing in there? Seriously, you sure? Garbage men can even find their way here. Hmm. But we've already looked at this, so someone will have. Where are you going? Are we done? Oh shit! Sorry, wrong button. Uh, no, not yet. No, let's just hang out, lady. Let's just hang out. Oh. What are you doing? You Better have nice legs. Oh. Sure, just hurry up. We don't have much time. You're such a creeper. You just want to stare at her legs. All right, let's go inside. Can someone you back this? Move her before anyone shows up. We'll find out more at the business office. She'll be in the books. I'm sure of it. Big P, do you have any idea what's going on? Someone brought her in from the Side. That makes sense. There's no signs of a struggle. But how do you know? I found blood on the fence back there. Someone slipped <laughs> over. Why okay. am I telling you this? You're suspect. That's solid. So someone from the outside. Well, at least they didn't come from inside the woodlands. I'm gonna have to tell Crane about this. Back the head. As Come on. As King Cole is gone, he's acting mayor. He needs to know. And he's going to find out anyway, so we may as well get out in front of it. We should wait until we have more to tell him. Right now, all we know is a girl is dead. Telling Crane doesn't change that. And I've got all the motivation I need to find out who did this. That sounds... Oh, yeah, reasonable. we were but really worried about your motivation. I hmm. I'll think about it. Just don't want him interfering. Yeah, we do not like this dude. Oh yeah, that was bureaucratic dude. Can Crane someone not back the head? Him. We need to figure out who this girl was so we can find whoever did this. Take this back to Dr. Swinehart. He can take a look at it. Swinehart. Alright. B.O. That's not a good acronym for business office, no. So sorry, ma'am. So sorry. Very sorry. What are you blind? What you don't see? There's a line. I've been standing here a half hour already. Well, you got a problem you hearing? Just walk in. Must be nice being the sheriff. Do whatever the fuck you like. I work here. And what great work you do, sheriff. Hmm. That didn't feel very genuine. Hmm. Fucker. Fuck you twice. Oh yeah, bureaucrat head. You're the one bringing this to me, Miss Snow. The one who so simply stumbled upon this catastrophe on our very doorstep. The last thing I need with Mayor Cole away is a hysteria. Do you understand me? Yes, of course I Don't do. Don't interrupt me, Miss Snow. You asked me a question. Don't change the subject. You are to blame for this unpleasantness, Miss Snow. I brought you this news as soon as I could. You are trusted to keep things running smoothly around here. This is a disaster. It isn't anyone's fault. Instead of trying to assign blame, maybe we should figure out how to catch the fucker who did this. Exactly. Oh, is that how you see things? Sheriff, that is how I see the one things. You charged with protecting the citizens of Fable Town. Your failure to do so cost someone their life and the safety of the entire community. Tell me you've been doing something. Are there any leads? Suspects? Anything. Anything at all. Any Why would I tell you? Evidence, you two know what the hell you're doing. Because right now, I have half a mind to fire the both of you. The woodsman is a person of interest. From what we've been able to gather, 
He was last seen with the victim. The woodsman? That drunk wretch was the cause of this? It's a lead. Nothing's certain yet. Well, find him. Get him in here if that's all you have to go on. You two need to get a handle on this situation quickly and quietly. The last thing we need is all of Fable Town knowing there's a killer amongst us. Snow. Yes? Sir? Call Vivian right this minute and let her know I'm coming in early for my massage. I will. Where is the bottle of wine you were to purchase? Am I a PA? What? what? Forget it! Can't do anything right. Fuck do you, old job, man. Sheriff. Or we'll find someone who can. You know what? Stop. We'll get on it right away, sir. I assume we're friends. No one pushes my friends around. Well, that could have gone better. Well, could have gone worse too. Listened to you and waited. Wasn't gonna say I told you so. You don't have to say it. Hmm. It would have been better to have more to offer. Get our ducks in a row. I'm looking for ducks now. Oh, Crane doesn't like people smoking and. Okay, let me smoke even more. Let me Never smoke mind. five in a row. Smoke away. Yes. Wine to a massage? Probably a gift. The weird part of that is that he's actually being nice to someone. I know I bought that damn bottle. What the hell? Is, is he gone? Yes, thankfully. <laughs> you twat. Buffkin! Hello, Miss Snow. Drinking? This early? Where did you get that? It was by Mr. Rickabod's desk. Then don't you think it probably belongs to him? Maybe. <laughs> How are you today, Mr. Bigby? How are you? Fine, Buffkin. Thanks for asking. Buffkin, get the books. Which books? The ones with all, all of the fables them. in it. Not sure that was any more specific. <laughs> the first three. Be back in oh, a few minutes. How many? He knows the ones I'm talking about. There's bound to be information on her here. Somewhere. We'll at least be able to get her real name from the books whenever Buffkin finds them. In the meantime, poke Buffkin. around. Maybe the mirror can help. The mirror. <gasps> right, the really mirror. Have to get this appointment squared away, but let me know if you need anything. Yeah, remember on the wall. It's not on the wall though. Hi. Waldo. <laughs> Fight Waldo. Worth a try. Ah, leave the genie in the bottle. Magic lamps are pretty much just lamps after the genie's been freed. Oh, the genie is not in it. That is just so disappointing. All right. Mirror, mirror on the wall. On hey, the stand. Magic mirror. Yo, mirror. No question. You know the rule. I don't have time for what this. What rule? Shit. Your impatience is callow. You're needlessly cruel, but have some respect for our history and rules. Uh, find them. Um... Mirror, mirror. If you're able. Tell me all about this fable. See? Was that so hard? Yeah, I'm about two seconds away from kicking a hole in you. There's no need for that. Fine. Of which fable do you wish to know? Show me the woodsman. Where is he? What Drunk. you see is complete. The woodsman stumbles down a street. No shit. Which street? I'm sorry, Bigby. I can only show you what can be seen. Show me Buffkin. CCTV. Hey, put down the bottle and get to work. <laughs> Still looking. <laughs> He's got a drinking problem. Show me Snow White. Not much of a request. She's in this very room. So what? I don't know her name. Not yet, anyway. Well, until you do, I can't help you. 
Well, we know where she is because she's dead. Hmm. Very well. Please return should you wish to ask about someone else or someone new. Hmm. Someone new. Something borrowed. Something blue. Mm. Bugs. Flipping heck, mate. Oh, Jesus Christ. <laughs> well, I'm sure we'll get it all cleared up. Okay. Thank you. I wonder if he's just overloaded or if he's drunk or everything. Constantly squatting. Must have strong legs. What are we looking for, guys? Books, 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 books. Where the books? Where the book? Ah. Pretty. We'll start with these. Any information on fables in our community will be somewhere in these books. She prints charming. East. Piggy. Colin and his brothers. Colin and his brothers. King something. I've seen this before. This symbol on the man's clothes, it's the same as the rings. Could be her father, or husband. This has most of the emblems of the old days, and usually what family they come from. If it's in here, we'll have her name. That's not it. Great. What? I can't read any of this shit. I can help. Yay. Yeah, thanks. We look out for each other. Don't overdo it. Bufkin, translate. Hmm, an exquisite design from the good china of Toad Hall. Mr. Toad? He probably wrote this in himself. Oh. That might be it. This is the one. Where is this symbol from? Which family or story? That's an odd one. Family name? Alairairo. You drunk again? Alairairo. Alairairo. Every kind of fur in German. Donkey skin. Alairairo. Yes. What does it say? <sighs> donkey skin girl, also known as donkey skin, also known as. <laughs> Askin <laughs> <laughs> prefers to go by the name Faith. Poetic? Buffkin, we don't need the commentary. The story of Donkey Skin. There was once a great king with a beautiful queen. The queen grew ill and had her husband promise to only marry the most beautiful girl in the kingdom. After a long search, it became clear that the only woman in the land that could match her beauty was uh, huh? his daughter. Oh. Faith. A magic cloak made from the skin of her father's prized donkey that would hide her beauty so she could escape his kingdom. Eventually, she married a prince who could see past the magic cloak and knew her true beauty. And they lived happily ever after. No. Should I mark it, Miss Snow? Yes. Please. And what's her husband's name? Lawrence. Prince Lawrence. Lawrence. All right, let's find. For. Find a mirror, find a Lawrence, Faith. dude. She was married to Prince Lawrence. I mean, that's more than we. Name was Faith. Yeah. You should talk to the husband. You think he did it? It's always the husband. With this sort of thing. It's usually the person who knew them best. Or it's someone completely random. Where's the mirror gone? There we go. Hey, mirror. Show me Faith, and then show me Lawrence. Mirror, mirror, blah, blah, Abel, blah, blah, blah about this fable. Of which fable do you wish to know? Faith. Show me... Show me faith. Through powerful magic, her whereabouts concealed. Unfortunately for you, these lips are sealed. What? 
these lips are sealed. Oh, everyone's it's saying that. It's not my choice of phrasing, Vicky. It's simply the way this has to be. Show me Faith's father, the old king. Oh. Guess that crosses him off the suspect list. He's a prince, I think. Show me Prince Lawrence. Uh, he's What's dead. What's he been doing? Two. Where he's is killed him. Where's what? Do you know where Prince Lawrence lives? If he's a prince, probably relocated in the South Bronx. Yellow building, red window shutters. Red frames. Yep, that's the one. I can take us there. That's where the princes live? Nobody right now. Anything we can use? Yeah, that'll have to do for now. Come on, we're going over there. Sorry, I have to get that. So you're the secretary. Hello, Woodland's business office. Yes, I... He is. Hold on. Bigby, it's for you. Bigby, it's me, Toad. You there? What do you want? Bigby, shit. Listen, right, there's a bloke upstairs going through all the woodsman's things. Get over here, Bigby, before he... Oh, wait, hang on. Boy, shit. Hey! What was that about? Hard to say. Something going on over at Toad's place. What about Faith's husband? I don't know. I couldn't really tell. But he could be in trouble. And we should go there anyway to search her apartment. Toad might have to wait. Oh, Whenever where are we going to go first? Um. Well, the husband looked dead, so... Did Toad say who was there? Was it the woodsman? I don't know. It's possible. Whoever it was, it didn't seem like Toad was happy to see him. Well, maybe Prince Lawrence can wait. Yeah, he didn't see him. He could use some help, too. Well, where to first? Fuck. That's probably going to make a huge difference now, whichever you choose. Listen, right? There's a bloke upstairs going through all the woodsman's things. You think he did it? What's her husband's name? Lawrence. Mm. I don't care about saving Prince Lawrence, though. If I can, even let's go to Toad. Toad sounds like he needs help right now. Exactly. Check in on Prince Lawrence. Okay, I'm not looking I forward so. to breaking the news to him anyway. Glass slipper shoes. <laughs> Got a prince. And we ended up going out the window and I landed on Toad's car. You guys made it. the day. <laughs> Sorry about that. Definitely not Woody, not the Toad either. Yeah, stay down here. I'm gonna get my face smashed in. Who put the mattress back? We might have killed Prince Lawrence for nothing. Let him die, I mean. Someone's gonna push me out the window on there. I'm sorry! That's enough, all right? Just shut it! <laughs> I don't even remember half of this shit. Hmm. Should probably get that fixed. Yeah, sorry about the sink. About the sofa. About everything. What kind of asshole swings a lamp at a guy? Someone with an axe in his face? Woodsman never did much reading anyway. Quite a drop, man. Anything else? Anything else? Um, so there's nothing in here, eh? was a waste. 
Aww. It's just a shining tricycle. <laughs> what's, what's going on now? Is that his son? Toads? I think. Be nice in there, okay? I'm always nice. Mostly. <laughs> hey, little toad. Big B! And Miss White! Surely you didn't come all this way just for my bother. Actually, I did. Sorry, Big V. It's embarrassing to have to admit, but uh, I thought it was someone else in Woody's place. It wasn't, though. Uh, not when I checked. Nothing but a leaky drain pipe. Imagination must have got the best of me. So, you know, false alarm. Sorry for dragging Miss White into this. We heard someone crying. Oh, the boy stabbed his toe on the bed frame is all. It stings, mm. but it's nothing to kick up a fight. I did about. that last night. It fucking hurts. Swim. He'll be right as rain, I'm sure. Hey, little toad. Are you all right? Oh, he's fine, Miss White. Just stung his little toe. Better swimmer than Walker, just like his dad. Wanna? So, I guess you'll be taking off now. No need to hang around here anymore. Yeah, really. I mean, I'm sorry you came all the way here for nothing. Someone was here, and something's going on. Just so this trip wasn't a complete waste of time, I'm gonna look around a bit before we leave, okay? The longer you talk, the longer this takes. So just stand over there and shut up. All right, all right. I just don't want to waste your time, is all. Uh, have a seat. Have a cup of tea. Whatever you like. Whew. Grown-ups. Am I right? Hmm. Uh. Hey, you know what? Flycatcher said you had a pretty awesome insect collection. I'd really love to see it. Is it in your room? It has a weevil. Cool. Just mind the upholstery while you're looking for nothing. Yeah, sure thing. I wanted to talk to the kid. He clearly must have seen shit. Now this happened. Fucking hell. Damn thing must have fell off the table. Mm. Uh -huh. The lamp just fell off the table. All the boy was typing about, playing salts and saltfish. Who knows with the lad? Hmm. I'll need to get a dustpan one of these days. Gee. Let me look around first. There's probably other shit. Where am I going now? Huh. <gasps> Blood. <laughs> you wanna lick it? Come on. Bleeding? Why? Is that blood? Still fresh? Oh, well, I'll cut me end. Ran around like a tit trying to pick out a wrap. Must have got some on the furnishments. Lamp in pieces, blood on the wall. It's awful, I know. Sounds painful. Hmm. Oi, don't you go mother-ending now. The wound didn't sit very long, you know. Perks have been a fable, I suppose. <laughs> and a frog. Okay, someone stabbed poker. something. Yeah. What happened? Oh, well, that's... That's how it happened, didn't it? Oh, I was... I was poking the coals and it slipped a bit. Sliced up in my foot like a seashell. Looked like a shit ugly thing. If you're gonna say something, out with it. Wait. You dropped it on your foot? You told me before that you cut your hand. Yeah, no. I, I did cut my hand. I cut my hand first, and that made me drop the damn thing on my foot. <laughs> uh, Rune is hell of a of day, place, really. Hmm. Totes. Hell of a day. Uh, 
Oh my god, will you not make a big faff out of this? There's nothing to solve here, Sheriff. I'm telling you everything that happened. Why don't you believe me? Because you're lying? I mean, things happen, you know. This apartment's a goddamn mess, Toad. Looks like after a struggle or a fight. And I don't know why you cover for it. But I know you're lying about something. But I'm not. And you're just going to make it worse for yourself the longer you keep up the act. I'm not bullshitting you. Honest. The son did something. Someone threatened daddy and the son came to the rescue. Didn't he? With the poker stick. So no one came through the window, eh? Oh, wait a sec. Open. And looky, looky, look. What is it now? If Nothing. Blood, you know what happened, I... No, there's marks here on the windowsill. And what's that about? No real reason. <laughs> Just last night, when <laughs> I'd come out, I was in a, a downright dizzy, mate, as you <laughs> would be. And <laughs> I plum forgot the keys to this place. And I had to climb in through the bloody window. Really? Hmm. Scared Junior off to death. Hmm. Other things. What other things? Oh, what's this? There's a mark over here, too. What do you mean? There's a clean space in the dust over here. Ah, oh, maybe one of Junior's toys or something? I mean, who knows? Okay, where's the lamp that was standing here? That's the lamp that was standing here, because the other ones are still plugged in. Bloody hell, Bigby. What sinister bit have you uncovered this time? I left the tap water running? Didn't stop the recycling? What's the point of all this, mate? Really? That broken lamp right, used to be here, right? Just tell me what happened. Nothing happened, mate. Nothing! And why did the lamp have to be there? Of all the blooming pointless inquiries. It's my own place. Don't you think I'll know what happens in it? Because the lamp was always over here, Toad. It was over here, and now it's there. The space in the dust is from where you oh, moved I it. did some refiguring. Who fucking cares? Refiguring. Oh, yeah, <laughs> mate. Come on, get off with this. Though most people think they are. Uh-huh. How's it going? Toad's hiding something, but I don't know what yet. Did the kid say anything? No, nothing really. He was really upset, though, earlier. He won't say why. Hmm. Something's going on. Stay with the kid until I figure out why. Okay, so the thing on the door here doesn't mean leaving. Oh, no, it doesn't. Okay. Why is the lock busted? Eh? The lock. It looks like somebody kicked in the door. A spot of dust and a broken lock. What are you getting at, mate? Oh, for Christ's sake, the fucking lock's been busted for weeks, mate. Right, it's just like everything else in this bloody building. It's just a busted Oh, I pressed the wrong button. Nothing to get your fur all wet. Big B. No. I'm back at the mercy of a rear old. I wanted to do I the other one. I was looking forward to a nice afternoon. Just me and me son, and you've taken up enough of a day with all this... this sniffing around at me private belongings. I'm sorry I called. Really, I am. But will you please, please just bugger off? Can you Not just... Yet. Not yet. No one fought anyone, Bigby. There wasn't any scrap. So when? When are you gonna leave? I mean, I feel like I'm on trial here. In my own bloody own. When? When you start telling me the truth, Toad. Well, I've told you the truth, mate. Jesus Christ, what more do you want? Why did I press the wrong button? Toad, these stories have made no sense. You didn't cut yourself on the poker. You didn't forget your keys. You want to tell me what's going on? 
She doesn't think much of me, I don't think. Oh, I wouldn't necessarily say that. Progress? Ah. Mr. Toad, you're bleeding. Take off the hat. <sighs> it was that butcher, a, a tweedle, dumb or dee. You gotta strip them down to their johnnies before you can tell which is which. They come bulging in, screaming about something the woodsman had. Or thought he had, I don't know. He tore up the place, beat me up when I said I didn't have it. I tried to go out the window, but he pulled me back in. <sighs> it's been a hard morning, I can tell you that. What was he looking for? I have no idea. I would have told you. I wanted to, really, I did. But he said if word of this ever got back to him, if he ever thought you knew, or well, Miss White, he'd come back and kill my boy. I even tried to give the bastard a coat. He wouldn't take it. Whose coat? The girl. Dad borrows things from people who live here. Uh, sometimes? Borrows? I don't steal nothing. Turn around here would astonish you, mate. We'll merely repossess what's been left behind. Well, we'll be taking the coat now. If she has next of kin, family, anyone. All right. Fetch him the fur. Fetch him the fur. Jesus. No, I wouldn't wear it outside. Piggy impersonator. Wait. It's an envelope. Fucking hell, of course there is. For my luck, it's a map to some bloody doubloons. It's addressed to Prince Lawrence. Do you want to try and give it to him, or...? Doesn't seem right opening another man's mail. Let's try and give it to him. Okay. Well, it's been quite a surprising yeah. day for all. When we find him dead, we can open the letter, yes. But I'm afraid of dripping any more blood in the place. I came here to help you, motherfucking toad. It was very nice talking to you, TJ. Thanks. Uh, see ya. Yeah, you're a pleasant one. Your dad, not so much. Where's Mama Toad? Does it always go that smoothly? Totally. Like Toad. So the totally. Lawrence's. <laughs> to Lawrence's! Our only lead, really. Not as long as we have one lead. Exactly. We've got one lead, that's all we need, mate. So all we need is one light. What do you mean early morning? I don't want to stay here any longer than we have to, so let's just pick an approach and stick to it, okay? Doesn't take us that long to get there, does it? Just humor me. We're here to question Lawrence. Bump him up on the suspect list, and we'll cross him off entirely. But we saw him dead in a mirror. I just... I just don't think he did it. In cases like these, isn't it usually the husband? Hmm. Mondays, maybe, but this is different. Alright, let's check it. Can you hear me? Yeah, you never find... Oh, he was just... Could we have saved him? Probably. If we hadn't gone to Toads. Oh my god. Go get Dr. Swinehart. I'll stay with no. him. No! No! He's still alive. What is it that you're telling us? 
Bigby, water. Kitchen. <laughs> yes, ma'am. Where's the kitchen? Where's the kitchen? Where's the kitchen? Where is the kitchen? Oh. Yeah, 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 coming, coming, coming. Uh, I'm not moving. There you go, mate. We could have probably saved him, huh? If you have something to ask him, you should do it now. Is this about faith? That was worth it. Okay, we should have gone here first. Do you still have that letter? <laughs> yeah, let's open it. Should I open it? Hmm. Mm -hmm. I'm not sure if it's right. You should. It might be something that helps us. A clue. Or a lead. I need to know. What does it say? I'm sorry. Fate. It's only two words. But he died without seeing them. I'm sorry too. We need to figure out what happened here, and find whoever did this. Bullet passed through the chair. works if he shot himself. Was there a knife? Or a bullet? When do you think that was taken? Before all this. Would someone want to kill him? So there's a knife and a bullet. There's the gun. on the grip and the trigger. Hmm. What are they? Prescription sleeping pills. That doesn't really help. Sorry.
strange. Hard edge to this pool like something was here and got moved. Draw the gun, something might be in there. I'll see you again. Love your devoted Lawrence. Hopefully they're together now. About all we can hope for at this point. Hmm. Secondhand paperbacks. Old encyclopedias. Dusty. No one's read these in a while. Someone in there? Get Stay him! Here. Should no. have had the gun. Who's waiting there patiently this entire time? Hey! Stop! Leave me alone! Sofa. Oh, God damn it, Big B. He's still okay. He can take a beating. He's up, Bigby. We're on the same side here. You son of a bitch. Make me run after you. Why <coughs> did you run? <coughs> what? Why did you run? Fuck, man. Because you chased after me. The fuck was I supposed to do? You ran first. I'm dead. I know how it looks, but I had nothing to do with that. Bullshit. You're covered in blood. Look, I was just asking him about the girl. That's all. When I mentioned her being dead, he freaked out. I figured someone had told him. How was I supposed to know? Shit. Fucker shot himself right in front of me. I couldn't stop him, man. You're looking for the woodsman, right? I know where he is. My guy says he's holed up at the trip trap. We can go over there right now, the both of us. My employer's looking to ask him a few questions too. Who's your employer? I can't tell you that. It's confidential. Sorry. Sure you understand. Nope. Can't say that I do. Come on. You're coming with me. This could have been easy. Huh. Oh, don't worry. It still is. Come on. Dumb. Dumb? Yeah, it is. Well, it could be much easier for you no, to... No, I'm D. He's dumb. <gasps> Whoops. We almost looked peaceful. Yep. Except you're lying in a dirty alley. Yeah. With an open wound on the back of your head. Yep. Yeah. Where'd they go? 
Well, after the one guy hit you, and the other one finished kicking you... That explains the ribs. Then they jumped into a car and drove off. Come on, get up. Guess we're out of options. D mentioned the trip trap. Then that's where we'll go. I'll call a cab. Let's call a cab. Mm, I think I need to turn the notifications for trophies off. Looks rubbish on the Twitch stream. Every time I think I'm getting a handle on what's going on, things just get more complicated. It feels like we're always a step behind. The woodsman is the only lead we've got, and he was one of the last people to see Faith alive. Getting some answers out of him will start to clear things up. I hope you're right. Bigby, be honest with me. Who do you think... Always my lovers. I'm not so sure. Early, but Too early to tell, man. I just feel a step behind. It's an uncomfortable feeling. I can't tell if you don't know or just won't say. I'm going to keep you in the dark. Thanks I wish you. there was... Sorry. Go ahead. I didn't mean to cut you off. No, it's... It's nothing. I just... Seeing all this today... There are fables that are struggling worse than I'd imagined. We pay so much attention to the residents of the woodlands. You forget there's a whole community out there to serve. To have to turn to... prostitution. I... I wish there was more we could do. This isn't how I thought it would be. But Crane runs things his own way. Then you should do something about it. You are in a position to make a difference. Obviously, you don't know what I do all day. Right now, I'm the gatekeeper, making sure none of these disenfranchised folks are, as he puts it, wasting his time. If you really want to help, you'll figure out a way. I don't know. It's just a broken system. The fables who walk in through the back door like Bluebeard, we have all the time in the world for them. You try and come in through the front door, through the proper channels, asking for anything, needing help. Well, I turn you away. Now things are worse off than they've ever been. Well, that's not true. Right. We've had it worse, but not by much. Maybe this isn't for me. I thought public service was pure. You'll figure it out. You're better than I am with this political stuff. Well, that's not saying much. I trust you to make the right decision. I hope you're right. I'm taking you to a dingy bar. Maybe you should handle this one. Oh, you're not coming. Yeah. Stay in the car. Maybe I should. Bigby. I... Um, just be careful. Please. The same goes for you. I will.
Right, let's do this. The trip trap bar in the Bronx. An earring. What do you want, Sheriff? Beer. I was in the neighborhood. Thought I'd pop in and say hello. Well, fucking hello. Now you can get the fuck out of here. Look, I'm not even gonna ask where he is now, okay? I just want to know the last time he was here. That's all. Who? I'm being nuts. So try again. He hasn't been here for a few weeks. No, maybe. I don't know. But yeah, he hasn't been here in a while, if he's been here at all, which... I don't know. I'd just like some help, and I'll be out of here. Well, I'd be willing to help you out of here. Would that help? Very helpful. How often can we use the word help? Click on everything! He a regular? I don't know who you're talking about. The one with the bald head and the beard. Last I saw him, he had an axe in his head. What about... A lot of these walk out the door? Yeah, it's called advertising. Is it? <laughs> you get a refund? Fuck you. The word's getting out. You'll never guess where I found the other one of these. No, I won't. <laughs> His place. Hmm. <laughs> is that someone who left oh he he's taking a piss is he someone like the guy I'm looking for no I'm telling you I haven't seen him for a couple days yo mate how you doing come on have you seen the woodsman around I don't know who that is big guy beard flannel kind of a shit bag hard to miss uh, Sure you don't know. Might still have an axe in his head. How about I buy you a drink? Why don't you keep your drink and piss off? Yo, Earring, you've got issues, man. Let me solve the mystery for you. They're pickled eggs. Oh, I know what they are. I'm just trying to figure out why anyone would eat this. I know. It's disgusting. Damn. A lot of stools in this place. But there's only one right next to you. You gonna <laughs> order something, or are you just here to bother my customers? You know what I mean. Give me a Midas gold. You want a wine? Sure. I think they have some at the bar down the street. <laughs> think that's funny? Yep. I think it's fucking hilarious. It was all right. This is serious, Holly. Harboring a fugitive is gonna get you in as much trouble as he's in. You could lose everything. Guess who that's gonna be? Let's rearrange the furniture in this place. Oh, 
Hola, amigo. ¿Qué pasa? You don't have an axe in your head anymore. Let me fix that for you. Just chilling with my homies. Number one or number two? For your sake, uh, I hope it was two. Otherwise, you're probably shitting your pants right now. You and me have been going at it for hundreds of years. Come through fighting. I'm not sure I believe you. You're in luck. I decided to switch seats. I just want to talk. This doesn't have to go like this. Maybe he don't want to talk to you. Why don't we yeah, let him tell me that? Exactly. Okay, Greg. It's funny. Just a minute ago, no one seemed to know who you were. Hmm. Yeah. Well, everyone knows you. Big bad one. Oh, I'm the bad guy and you're a sheriff. What kind of fucking world is that, huh? Come on, Woody. You know why I'm here. You want to know what happened? Amongst other things, sure. <laughs> it's funny. The shit you're willing to do for money. I'd walk past her place for weeks. She didn't look like it. She had money. I was sure of it. She wouldn't put up any kind of fight. And the night I finally get up the nerve to do it, there you are, fucking things up for me. You were just in the wrong place at the wrong time. So, you were planning on robbing her? Yeah, her and her grandma. Grandma? Wait, what are you talking about? Red Riding Hood, her grandmother. I was there to rob them. But when I showed up, you were already there, lying in the bed. I only saved her because I thought she might give me a reward. But she didn't give me shit. Except a bunch of people thinking I'm something I ain't. I played along as long as I could. I already know this story, Woody. You should. You were there. I'm not talking about Red Riding Hood. I'm here about Faith. She was murdered. What? Faith? Who's that? The girl you were beaten on this morning. No, 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 no. I, I was here. I swear. It doesn't look good when a girl you were just smacking around shows up dead hours later. Hmm. She's dead? Big B, listen, I, I'm a piece of shit, okay? I know that. I hit that girl. I did. I, I shouldn't have, but I didn't kill her. You believe me, right? They're gonna string me up, Big B. Like you said, it looks fucking bad. It looks really bad. Bad, but I didn't do it. He was here. That's the fucking truth, Sheriff. You see? Bigby, please. You can't. They'll throw me down the witching well. That's what they'll do. And I didn't do it. You know that. Hey, stop! This isn't what I want. Oh, shut the fuck up, Woody! Shit ain't just about you. It's about this fucking lapdog. And he comes sniffing around this part of town when the rich fucks in the woodlands need a shakedown. Ain't that right, Bigby? It's not like that. There are problems with the way things go, I get it. But that's got nothing to do with what's happening right now. Holly's sister goes missing. No one gives two shits about her. Paperwork. Waiting rooms, and that bitch Snow White looking right past me, then ushering me out the fucking door. I wouldn't call her that. It's happened before, and it doesn't end well. I didn't realize you were the bitch of the bitch. Is that all you?
you got? Seem to be enough. Don't be so sure. Uh oh. Oh, good. What the fuck is he? Should have walked out of here when you had the chance. Come on, you're scaring the lady. Don't worry about me. What's going on? Is he a golem? What the? Ow. Don't destroy the pool table. Too much fun, too much fun, too much. Ooh. Sorry, I got distracted. Exit. Yeah, let's leave. Fuck you, asshole. Oh, wow, that must hurt. Oh, apparently not. Jeepers. He's like the Hulk. Oh, fuck me. Yeah, it's not going very well. Uh-oh. What am I holding on to? <gasps> I've wolfed. Oh, this, this is probably not good. Huff and puff. <laughs> well, we're both not in human form anymore, so it's equalized. I'm going to take his arm off. Oh, fuck me. Yeah, cue him. <gasps> not for kids, not for kids. And the knee again, here we go. Okay, fine. I think last time I tore off his arm. Fucker attacked me, man. I'm just defending myself. Whiskey. Whiskey now. Give me the bottle. Double. Hand me a fucking bottle, man. Ah, oh, that de-wolves you, okay. Submit a damage report with my office. Fabletown will pay for this. Charge the drink on there, too. And the glass. Uh uh uh, Woods. Don't even think about it. Is this the type of treatment I can expect if I let you take me in? He smashed my face in. You smashed my face in. Hey, he started it. You hit him first. Yeah, but he was being an asshole. Yeah, he said, bitch. Bitch. Is it. Uh, who's it? Riddle Dean, Riddle Dean. I got a hundred bucks for the first bloke that can tell me something about a girl name. Fuck. Named Fuck? <laughs> I was just leaving. to the woodsman. Ah, you said you wouldn't hurt me. You said you wouldn't run. Exactly. Shit. Guys covered in blood and you Stupid let him go? Decisions. No one asked you. Ah, come on. 
You're under arrest. I didn't do it. And you got nothing to worry about. Days go really quickly here. Mmm, breakfast and lunch. Do anything stupid, and I'll throw you down the witching well myself. All right. Oh, not again. Oh my god, I remember this one. Oh, that shocked the shit out of me. Where's the police officers coming from all of a sudden? Like, I'm the sheriff. So there are police officers, but they don't help me being the sheriff of the town. Fuck. The first time I saw that, I was like, oh, No, I liked her! No! Light snowfall. <laughs> so of those trophy names. Very special. Who else is involved? The girl with the coat. Serial killer. Oh, oh my. A serial killer. Oh God, and it's one of us. Fat guy still walking the streets. We've got to put a lid on this. If you can't manage it, I'll find someone who can. I found out where she's been staying. I know she's here. You must have seen her. What are the two of you hiding? Thanks. I'm not saying anything. Doesn't matter. Maybe you just want to punch someone. We can arrange that. Uh, what did you do? <laughs> friend on friend. At the end of the end. Jesus Christ, baby. Is that you? Whoa. Nice. Yeah. Pretty much everyone gave him money. Oh, usually people get involved with shit. Most players went to see Toad. You did not prevent Prince Lawrence's death, so you can prevent it. Huh. Interesting. Cool. Well, thank you very much for watching. Check out episode two. Cheers. Wait, what? Why doesn't it end up here? Stop.